Hello friends. Now let's discuss excretory organs in animals. What is mean by excretion? Excretion is a metabolic activity in which the waste materials are removed out of the body. Excretion of waste material is an essential task of an organism. During the metabolism in every living organism, the waste materials are regularly generated or formed. If these waste materials are not excreted out, they get deposited in the body of an organism and they become poisonous and they may lead to the death of an organism so the waste materials are to be excreted or eliminated out regularly if the waste materials are not eliminated that will become very danger to the organism so for the elimination of waste materials all the organisms they have developed a particular kind of organs or systems or some methods or some cells for the process of elimination of waste material so elimination of waste material is excretion for the process of excretion or to carry out excretion there will be an organ that organ is excretory organ so excretory organs are present in every organisms to perform excretion process but here in every organism that may be unicellular organism or that may be multicellular organism whatever the organism it may be the process of excretion is essential and very common but here one thing we must notice the organ which is present for the process of excretion may not be same in all the organisms excretion process is common in all the organism but excretory organs are not common the excretory organs varies from organism to organism so here we are going to concentrate what kind of excretory organs are present in all the animals all the animals may not have the same kind of excretory organs so what are the differences in excretory organs let's concentrate on all these issues first of all let's see the all the animals are divided into two kinds broadly they are vertebrates and non vertebrates this classification is done based on the presence of uh, backbone or spinal cord here vertebrates means the organisms having spinal cord non vertebrates the organisms not having spinal cord in all the vertebrates and non vertebrates what kind of excretory organs are present let's just concentrate here now first of all protozoa protozoa is a group in which all the unicellular organisms are present the organisms like amoeba paramecium euglena all these organisms come under the group protozoa in protozoans how excretion takes place excretion in protozoans takes place by the process of simple diffusion simple diffusion that means diffusion means a movement of substances or molecule from high concentrated area to low concentrated area during the metabolisms in the organisms of protozoa group all the waste materials are formed inside the cell and uh, this waste material concentration increases in the cell so that from higher concentrated area to the waste material move out of that cell like this excretion takes place in protozoa organisms and next one porifera porifera is a group in which the organism sponges come under porifera the organisms are fixed organisms they cannot move at all then how do they excrete the organisms of porifera group they excrete the waste material simply by bathing of all cells the water baths all the cells so all the cells simply they take bath of water that means the water flows throughout all the cells so what happens the waste materials present in the cell is carried away by the water so this is what water bathing of cells is a method which takes place in porifera organisms to carry out the process of excretion and next coelenterata coelenterata is a group uh, the organisms come under coelenterata are hydra and jellyfish in the organisms of coelenterata group they also adopt the same method water bathing of cells for the elimination of waste materials if we come to platyhelminthes tapeworm the liver fluke all these organisms come under platyhelminthes group in platyhelminthes group flame cells are the cells these are specially developed cells only for the process of excretion so through flame cells excretion process occur in platyhelminthes organisms next nematyhelminthes it is also known as nematoda group in nematoda group ascar is the organism ascaris lumbricoides the organism best example for this group is ascaris the organisms of nematyhelminthes group they perform excretion by using rennet cells they contain rennet cells for the process of excretion and next 
Anelida group. Anelida means the organisms like earthworm and the leech, they come under Anelida. Uh, the organisms of Anelida, they have a special organ, Nephridia, for excretion of waste material. So, Nephridia are the excretory organ in Anelida group. And next, Arthropoda group. Arthropoda, the speciality of Arthropoda group is, it is the largest group present in animal kingdom. More number of organisms are included in the group Arthropoda and uh, it is the largest group. So, the organisms of Arthropoda, they excrete waste material by green glands and malphysian tubules. These are the two kinds of excretory organs present in Arthropoda organisms. And next one, Mollusca. Snail is the best example for Mollusca. The organisms of Mollusca group, they excrete waste materials by using Metanephridia. Metanephridia is an excretory organ in Mollusca group. And next one, Echinodermata. Starfish is the best example for Echinodermata. So in Echinodermata, the excretory system is water vascular system. And next one, vertebrates. Vertebrates means all the organisms having spinal cord are vertebrates. In all the vertebrates, kidneys are the excretory organs. All the vertebrates developed kidneys uh, as excretory organs. Through kidneys, they eliminate the waste material. So we observe from protozoa to echinodermata, so many variations are found in excretory organs. And finally, if we come to vertebrates, all the vertebrates, they have developed kidneys as excretory organs. So here, by observing all these things here, we can understand one thing that all the organisms, they excrete waste material for their survival. But here one thing is, excretory organs are different. The process of excretion is common, but existence of excretory organs is not common. The excretory organs are different from one organism to other organism. Like this, animals do not have same kind of excretory organs. The excretory organs vary from one organism to other organism.